Up until now, I haven't said anything, as I was too young. I've just tried to block it out. I've tried to understand over and over why, at such a young age, my brother lost his life so tragically. But I have no answers. He's just 16 years old, but today, Thomas Kelly's little brother, Stuart, would have made him proud. I want Thomas's short life to have some meaning in his death, so we can see change. A new, fresh start. One where I believe we should have respect for one another. For our friends, family, acquaintances, different cultures and complete strangers. I want to see the values and relationships where having fun with friends on a night out means just that, existing without the need for excessive drinking, where any violence is totally unacceptable in our society. Kieran Loveridge was initially sentenced to just over five years for killing Thomas and assaulting several others in a night of violence in July 2012. After an appeal against that leniency, a court today doubled it to 10 years and two months. He'll be jailed until at least 2022, but that's cold comfort for the Kelly family. Still very sad and I think that people don't realise that um, the pain just goes on every day. We miss our son. He died for no reason. Today, the Kelly family are again the public face of a grief that affects thousands of Australians every year. I was only 14 when Thomas was killed in a violent, unprovoked act that changed our family's lives forever. I now no longer have an older brother. Instead, I have a hole in my life that somehow I'm meant to come to terms with and accept. In three days, the Kelly family face the painful two-year anniversary of the day their world imploded. I'll miss Thomas deeply for the rest of my life, but somehow I know that he will always be there by my side. And to honour his big brother's memory, Stuart has a challenge for all of us. It's my generation and yours. It's ours. To begin this conversation at home, across the dinner table, in our schools, our universities and amongst peer groups. You too can be a messenger of change.